second day of the siege, prior to the Battle of the Alamo, Colonel Travis wrote the following letter, an appeal for reinforcements. Commandancy of the Alamo, there, February 24th, 1836. To the people of Texas and all Americans in the world, fellow citizens and compatriots, I am besieged by a thousand or more Mexicans under Santana. I have sustained a continual bombardment and cannonade for 24 hours and have not lost a man. The enemy has demanded surrender at discretion. Otherwise, the garrison are put to the sword the fort is taken. I have answered the demand with a cannon shot, and our flag still waves proudly from the walls. I shall never surrender or retreat. Then I call on you, in the name of liberty, of patriotism, and everything dear to the American character, to come to our aid with all dispatch. The enemy is receiving reinforcements daily, and will no doubt increase to three or four thousand in four or five days. If this call is neglected, I am determined to sustain myself as long as possible, and die like a soldier who never forgets what is due to his own honor and that of his country. Victory or death. William Barry Travis, Lieutenant Colonel Commodore. P.S. The Lord is on our side. When the enemy appeared in sight, we had not three bushels of corn. We have since found in deserted houses 80 or 90 bushels, and got into the walls 20 or 30 head of bees. Travis. In remembrance of those who served in the revolution of Texas, I now invite you to witness presentation of the colors by the Texan Volunteer Army of 1836. Commander, present the colors. Present.